Hi all, welcome back. In this module, we are going to talk about a tracking sensor. Right? So what is a tracking sensor is basically uh, uh, if you go to any retail store and you would like to use uh, buy something. Uh, so there are certain barcodes, right? So basically what happens like you have a, a reader which uh, reads this, right? So that is what the tracking sensor is predominantly used for. Right. So what we will do is uh, uh, we will I'll show you my tracking sensor. Okay, which looks something like this. It has got a three pins. Okay, uh, one of the pin is a output, and other two are voltage in. Right. So what happens? Uh, I do have. Um, so there are uh, a receiver and the transmitter. The infrared receiver and the transmitter over here. And uh, whenever it identifies a black object or a black lines, right, on a paper or something, the rays are emitted back, uh, the rays are uh, um, absorbed, okay, and uh, uh, so whatever is the IR uh, uh, emitter is there, right, so when, when, when it sends out, uh, it is continuously sending out the IR rays. So if I have a black line, the rays are getting absorbed. Okay, so the value is uh, 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 high. Otherwise, if it is not a black line, it will be uh, uh, um, a low. Okay, and the rays will be uh, uh, reflecting back from a uh, uh, from. If it is a transparent, then it will pass through. But if it is not transparent, it will reflect back. Okay, in both the cases, it would be low. So let me quickly connect this, okay, little bit theory and then I'll quickly connect it. So it's very simple. I'll connect my ground. Uh, I'll connect my VCC, okay. And in currently in this module, I have a center pin which is which will act as an output, okay. So uh, I'll do that for you, okay. Right. So now the things are connected. Okay, I have a very small code. I'll also try to show you that code. Okay, uh, one thing is that I'm uh, just starting this, uh, deploying the sample code. Okay, and then I'm reading the output from the pin number two. Okay, so basically, whatever the output the sensor is sending, I'm just trying to display it on my serial monitor. So let me just show you. Uh, I have already deployed the code. If you see, it's all one, 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 one. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, uh, uh, I have a surface, a black surface. Let me just quickly do that. Okay. And uh, somehow, okay, so I have this thing, a very black one. Okay. I'm expecting it will not, uh, uh, it will be absorbed, but I would need a black uh, on a paper. Okay. So I, I have to really see if I have a paper and I can draw that. But if I, if this is not working, you, what you can do, you guys can draw it on a paper and then see whether uh, uh, the value that you are expecting is or not. Okay, so let me just quickly show you that to you. Okay, so let me just try to do something. Mm, okay. Right. Okay. So right now it's not working with this uh, plastic box, which is a black color, but you can try it out on a paper. Okay, and um, hopefully it should work. Okay, so thanks for joining this session. We'll meet for the more sensor in the next class. Thank you.